Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker Dana Opera Realtors. Well, today I'm at Estrella in Cibolo Canyons. Wonderful community built by Chesmar. Unfortunately, this community has completely sold out. However, I do have buyers looking to buy to build the same model behind me. This is the Rockwell. It is a gorgeous home. Let's go check it out. This home is a four bedroom, 3,500 square foot home built by Chesmar. Obviously, it's under construction, and if you see all this foundation, that is because the topography of the hill is going from the back of the property to the front. So, yes, they definitely have some foundation in there, and it's created a unique, uh, super tall garage. I just love the uh, peaks on this house. It's like a little mini Hogwarts. So, yes, I'm making another Harry Potter reference. But, uh, man, this is a beautiful home. Uh, my clients are considering getting one of these built, and they might do a double door on the front area there. That would look so cool. But anyways, let's go check out to see what this home is looking like as of today. What is it? I think it's 9 April 2021. This is a three-car garage. This is a giant three-car garage just because of the topography. They had to cut in a lot to do this garage so the driveway wouldn't be like straight up. All right, we're gonna pretend we are just walking in the front door here, and this is what you see. Just a beautiful wall of windows going way up. Wow, this is nice. It's a two-story home, beautiful section up there but we'll get to it right now we're looking at the main living space they do have a fireplace that's going to go all the way up that's going to be super cool this area here is going to be the kitchen it is going to have a double island And uh, we're going to have a sink in this island here and another island. And right behind me, I'm assuming that right behind all this sheetrock is going to be, okay, this is where cabinet space is going to be. And then more cabinets. Uh, it might be cabinets or it might be just a breakfast nook area back there, but nice lots of space here definitely more cabinets on the other side there you can see all the outlets for that and outlets along this wall here so this house will have uh no shortages of cabinets you can see the venta hood for the stove which is going to be right there but just really super cool This house does come with a really large covered patio. The fireplace is extra, but it's gonna have a really nice covered patio area. Right up front is gonna be where your office is gonna be. It looks like they're gonna have some, uh, some type of French doors right here right when you come in. Come around the corner, here is the owner's suite. You can tell they're gonna be having that uh, A-frame roof in here. Lots of windows, some great lighting in this house. And this can be a really big bedroom. Checking out the owner's suite bathroom. You're gonna have two different vanities at different locations. A big uh, soaking tub right here. Your linen closet right there, and the other vanity. There's your, gonna be your water closet right over here. Like I said, we talked about the soaking tub, but look at the size of this shower. This thing is gonna be massive. Mud, I mean an inset shower, so this is already built into the foundation. Long uh, bench there, lots of space. Really tall ceilings in this house. So uh, they, at least this time, this house has the window up high enough. So it's a little work if someone wants to look at the window to see your bits and pieces. 
but this is, will be the closet and it's a big one looks like it's kind of wrapping around a little bit here so it's a his and her side closet coming around this way and let's see yeah looks like there's a door here okay this is the door to the laundry room okay very nice i i've mentioned all the time in the video i do like seeing doors to the laundry room but this plan does have a door right into the laundry room from your closet very cool your uh, control box where all your ethernet cables alarm modems all that can be can routed right into your closet so they can be tucked away access to the laundry room from the outside and then kind of tucked away in the corner this room once again tall ceilings tall windows this is a perfect long-term guest room because it's got its own full bath with a shower right there and you can see they got a closet as well So perfect if you have an older kid or a guest that's been wanting to use that room. It does have eight foot doors throughout. Let's head upstairs. They are gonna have a nice little bench set up here right when you come up the first little layer level of stairs. But they also have the powder room kind of halfway up so you've got your toilet right there and your sink let's keep going up the stairs once again a nice big play area here loft poker room whatever you want to do with it you're gonna have Two more additional bedrooms upstairs. Looks like a big closet right here. One bedroom on this corner of the house with its own closet. And these are what I like to call those uh, mini walk-in closets. Another really good sized bedroom. Might have got turned around because I see the door framing for this. Okay, yeah. So they're just kind of side-by-side -side closets right there. And this bedroom has its own full bathroom as well. So all these bedrooms have their own bathrooms for it. Although this one's kind of open to everyone using the playroom area. Or the loft area here. But one... That I love about this loft here is there's another patio outside. So yes, there's an upstairs giant covered patio. So if you have a, a lot with an amazing view out the back, you're going to be up really high and be able to see for a long, long ways. And this is really super cool to have if you're on a lot with a view. Be able to put your patio furniture out here, a full set of patio furniture, maybe a little uh, propane fire pit, and just sit out here and just enjoy the evening. Depending on which direction the sun's facing, this house uh, is going to be a little warm because that, that sun's creeping down. You can tell you've got the sun on the back patio, which you always have to pay attention to. That's never a good thing in Texas because it does get a little warm here, especially during the summertime. And uh, when you get off work, that's when you want to have your adult beverage on the back porch. But nice little view from above.
All right, let's head back downstairs. One last view of the lower level. You can picture the two different vanities, cabinets on both sides of this, lots of, a uh, lot of space. And then you go to the giant vaulted gate, great room here. And then your office with a French doors. And the view from the back of the house, see that beautiful double-decker double patio deck area. Really cool design. All right, that's gonna wrap up the tour. This beautiful home built by Chessmar. This is the Rockwell plan, a four bedroom, 3,500 square foot home. There's only a couple communities in the area that build this tier of Chessmar homes. Um, Australia, they're closed out now and um, Harvest Hills, sorry, taking a second, Harvest Hills. And there's another community out in Casterville that's gonna be able to build this level of Chessmar homes. Homestead's getting ready to start building Chessmar homes, but I don't know if they're building this level. They just might. Anyways, hope you liked this video and hope it helped you out. And uh, if you do like these videos, like, subscribe, and keep sharing with your friends. All right, talk to you soon. Take care now. Bye.